Today's question I was asked, why is crypto falling right now? My answer is because we are in a bear market and getting rid of a lot of bad players in the game. The crypto market is still growing and learning from a lot of scammers and mistakes. When I started in 2017, I learned about the halving. The crypto market has every four years. And in those years, we have a bull and bear market that will have sideways pattern at times in the market. Bad news can also make the market fall. Having a plan and learning how to play is key to winning, but I would say you need to go through a bear and bull market to really learn and sometimes maybe two different cycles to get some good experience under your belt to know how to tackle each cycle. This is not financial advice, but you have to learn and come up with your own plan that fits you and your family. If this helps, hit the like button and subscribe. And thanks for watching. And now to some news. Right. Are we winning? Or what are we learning and investing today? What's up, y'all? Welcome to Digger Crypto. And today we're going to have a little bit of news and what's going on in the market. So let's jump in the market real fast. We see the market cap is 875 billion, up 2%, 2.2%. The volume is 52 billion. We up 14.7%. And the Bitcoin dominance is 36.2%. That's down a little bit, y'all. So we looking at the first 10 coins, because we ain't gonna go too far. The main thing is the first 10 coins. So we looking at the first 10 coins, everything's in the green, y'all. Bitcoin up 1%, Ethereum up 3%. Woo, Dogecoin, boy. Whoever got some Dogecoin up 9% right now. So the market is looking like it's trying to uh, recover from earlier because earlier, whoo, we were sinking. Let's jump into some news though, y'all. So as you can see, Mark Mobius sees Bitcoin falling to 10,000. I don't know. It could fall to 10,000 or it could keep going up. Who knows? In due time. Cardano ass swap goes live on the main net. So Cardano steady trying to pull things off to uh, keep growing and expanding. And JP Morgan expects major changes coming to crypto industry and regulations post FTX. So let's go on and jump into that what see what they talking about. JP Morgan has outlined key changes. It is expected the crypto industry and regulations following the collapse of crypto exchange FTX. Boy, FTX messed up for a lot of people. A lot of a lot of exchanges sinking down the drain. Well, I guess, like I said, you got it. That's the reason why crypto falling because they got to get rid of those bad players. A lot of bad players and scammers in the game. We got to get rid of them guys. It says JP Morgan strategies expect the European Union marketing crypto asset MICA bill to receive final approval before year end and the regulation to take effect at some point in 2024. So in 2024, I, I believe we're going to be starting to rise up around that time because that's when the next having going to be coming around the corner to take place. As for the U.S., he explains that regulatory attract more interest following terror collapse, adding our guess is that there will be even more urgency following the FTS collapse. So I guess they, J, JP Morgan, they, I guess they're coming in to take over something. They coming in to buy something or to see how can they fit themselves in the game and take over and have regulations coming. So, I mean, that's, to me, that's a good thing. We need regulations because there's a lot of people in the game that, that's kind of messing up and making a lot of people lose money i didn't lost money in the game so with that being said if you like this video hit the like button subscribe and i will keep bringing you guys more news more knowledge on the crypto space as we growing so you guys can have more ready to get in there in the game to invest or, or do what you need to do to uh learn in this market Never forget where you come from. DJ, drop the beat. From the hood, now I'm a star. Watch me grow. Watch me grow. <laughs> 